Over 18,000 people flooded the city of Bridges when Ragbri rolled through this summer. But the question remains, how much revenue did it generate for local businesses? KTV Sean Redfield spoke with Mita Tumwa's executive director to discuss the financial impact the event had on the community. When Ragbri passed through Atuma two months ago, local vendors, restaurants, and businesses saw a significant boost in revenue. The influx of thousands of cyclists and visitors created a surge in demand for food, drinks, and services, with eateries and alcohol vendors benefiting particularly from the increased foot traffic. So they're looking at about $400,000 just for vendors and local businesses, food service, um, drinking establishments, any place that served alcohol that day, looking at about another $200,000 that came into the community. We also estimated that those 18,000 people, even just general merchandise from gas to picking up swag while they're in Atumwa, um, probably another $100,000. So looking at another total of about $700,000 of economic impact. Kura highlights how serving as an overnight host city for Ragbri significantly increased the revenue generated from the event. The pass-through communities and the meeting towns have Ragbri riders in for an hour, two hours, three hours. We were able to keep them for over 12 hours and they had an opportunity to explore the community, to find our local restaurants, to go shop where they wouldn't normally shop. So having an overnight stay in town made a huge difference in economic impact. Hotels and motels in the area were nearly fully booked during Ragbri, contributing to a substantial increase in revenue. Kuro adds that the money Mitatoma earned from the event was reinvested to promote future activities and events in Atoma.